And so for this video I'm going to do a review and a first impressions on the Unique 3D Fibre Lash. Um, and this has been talked about on like so many people's YouTubes. Um, so it's quite a new product and a lot of people are just wanting to try it, see if it really works. So that's what this video is. So it comes in this like sort of glasses case. And inside, it's quite dark, but inside you've got a natural fibre, like they're like two mascaras basically. Like that one's a lot smaller than the other one and the bigger one's a transplanting gel and the bigger one, the smaller one sorry, is the natural fibres. Um, so yeah, it comes in the case. This retails for £23 I believe. Um, and it's just supposed to make your lashes look a lot fuller and lashes look a lot fuller than using just mascara. It's supposed to be like sort of false lashes without applying false lashes. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna do uh, first impressions of this. You put on a coat of your favorite everyday mascara. Right, so I'm using L'Oreal Miss Manga Mascara. I could really do with a mirror right now. Okay, so that, that is one coat of my normal mascara on my eyes and I'm only going to like leave us one coat because that's what I use on like a daily basis anyway. So I'm going to leave the left one with that on it and then I'm going to put the 3D Fibre Lash on my right one. So you just, you're supposed to put on your mascara and then wait for it to dry. So I just thought I'd show you before I started that this, because like, you have to put a coat of the gel on and then like straight away put the fibres on. So I'm just going to show you the fibre thing now because I'm not going to have time to show you at the time. Um, so it's like this wand which it just like, I don't know if you can see, it's just fluffy basically. And that's what you're supposed to put on your eyes. So my mascara has dried. So I'm going to take one coat of the transplanting gel. So this just looks like a normal mascara brush. And put one coat of that. I don't know if you're supposed to put it on your bottom lashes, but I am. Okay. So that's a transplanting gel on, and you're not allowed to give it like enough time to dry. And then you start applying the fibers. Oh my god, they're falling. I don't really know how much of this stuff you're supposed to apply. I know that you can build it up with like more coats and everything. <laughs> See look like the fibres are like clumping. They are clumping. So that's the fibres on and then you're supposed to just do another coat of the transplanting gel to sort of like lock them in. Okay so that's like one coat. That's one eye with a coat of the fibre lashes and one eye with just normal mascara and to be honest there isn't like that big a difference but you can see like that took a hell of a lot more time. I don't know if you can see but I've got like fibres on my face. I suppose it does make your lashes look a bit more like volumised and full but for like everyday wear I don't know whether I'd go to all the effort of applying this and I think I've got one in, I think I've got one in my eye which is quite worrying me because I've just applied it and if I'm already gonna get them in my eye that's not good because I don't know whether that this product is worth the money 
um, obviously if you want to go and try it you can try it but I just think that all that extra like, time didn't really make in a lot of difference like, that's just one coat of mascara that's a coat of mascara with the fibre lashes and if I was to do like another coat of mascara this would probably look the same so yeah I think you're even like for the money you're just cheaper off cheaper off, better off buying a decent mascara and buying two coats really. If you enjoyed this review, hopefully like it gave you an idea of whether you would like this product or not. Give it a thumbs up if you did like it and leave some comments down below for what you'd like to see in the future. So yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye!